Are you losing energy trying to force life to happen? You know, I think so many of us, we have goals, we have visions, we have, you know, things that we want to accomplish in our business and in our lives and revenue wise and all these different things. And we try to force it to make it happen. We try to push it, move it, make it do what it is that we want it to do. And as a result, we lose so much energy trying to force things. I was just watching, rewatching the latest movie, Dune, uh, the latest version of it. And there's a great scene in that where Paul and his mother are flying this craft into this sandstorm. They're being chased by the bad guys, you know. And they fly into this sandstorm. And this is a desert planet. So this just ain't isn't any regular sandstorm. This sandstorm destroys and kills and all these different things. So they fly into it. And the ship is beginning to crack and get work because he's trying to force it through the tides and ebbs of this sandstorm. And let's face it, we all encounter sandstorms in our experience. And we all do have this tendency to try to force it and make things move in a certain direction. Well, then he has this vision. And in this vision, there's this voice that tells him to let go. Quit trying to force it to happen. To let go and to trust the flow of life. And so he let go of the controls and the wings were tracked in. And the ship begins to spin around and fly wildly through this sandstorm. Until it rises above the sandstorm itself. And I thought, wow, what a great metaphor for our lives. Because we're all trying to fly through the sandstorms of our own life experience trying to make things happen, trying to force things to move into things. What would happen if we were to just let go and trust in the flow? Now, what's interesting in this analogy is they had a vision. He had a vision to be on the other side of this storm, to get away from these people that were chasing him, to get away, to be on the other side of the storm, to get out into the desert. So he had a vision as you must have a vision for your life. What are you stepping into? What are you moving into? What are you creating? What are you composing? What are you drawing? What are you painting? What are you manifesting? What does your soul want to express in this lifetime? That becomes our vision. And the more that we can create that vision from a space of unlimited, of being unlimited, as opposed to based on past experiences and all that wonderful stuff we've gone through in life, all kinds of things can open. But the key step to really enhance our journey through life is to let go and to quit trying to force. And by doing so, we free up so much energy that we expend trying to make life unfold to our schedule in the way that we think it should. Ha! <laughs> it's not going to, okay? I uh, Just trust me on that. It's going to have its own tides and ebbs, its own sandstorm, its own winds, its own breezes. And when we let go, we allow ourselves to move through that, never losing our end result, vision, dream, desire that we have, but trusting in the flow of the experience. So just take some deep breaths. Look at your life right now. Where are you trying to force life to happen? trying to force your kids to be a certain way or produce certain results in your business. Reconnect to the vision. Take some deep breaths. Trusting the universe. To bring you the house and everything you need. To reach the desire, the goal.
while flowing down this river, this river of life. Trying to tell it where to go, what to do, and how to flow. But if you just let go. All kinds of miracles can begin to unfold. Trust in your vision. Trust in the universe. So just deep inhale. expression of life, of possibility. And when you have this mastered, please comment below. Let us know. We'd love to hear your progress because it's a journey. It's a process. It's a learning. It's an unfolding. Do we master it overnight? Well, there's always the potential to do that. Let's not limit ourselves. But for the most part, we're going to have to learn and move and evolve into this. But so much can open up for you if you are just to quit trying to force and to let go. You free up so much creative energy. You free up so much possibility. You begin to tap into your intuition, your inner guidance, looking for the synchronicities and the breadcrumbs that are going to lead you on the journey to moving through the sandstorms that you might be experiencing in your life so that you can reach your end goal, so that you can have that experience, that experience of life. So we all have come here to play. And now more than ever, it's so important for us to just let go and trust in our creative power, our creative ability, and that the universe is more than happy to join along with us and to bring those dreams, those visions, those insights, those goals, those solutions to fruition. So that you continue to enhance, enjoy, and move through and evolve through your journey. Thank you so much for being here. Hey, I love this song I was playing today. It's a little bit of a different version, but if you want to, you can get a free um, track of this very song. It's called The Journey, and it's a piece to support you on your journey through life. So anytime you're struggling, anytime you're you know meeting some challenges, you just play this track, breathe in the notes, and it'll dramatically help you in your experience. So um, please, there's a link in this uh, comment below. Make sure you sign up to get that track. I, and there's a little workbook that comes with it. Just a little something to help you to uh, enhance your journey to your life experience. Thank you so much for being here. Have a happy and harmonious day.